With the holidays upon us, Americans will be spending more and charging more than they do any other time of the year. With credit card debt already at $1 trillion, the highest since 2008, more and more people should be looking for ways to avoid those high interest rates and those fees. So personal finance expert Andrea Warwick is here to help us. Andrea, thank you so much for being with us. Of course, I'm so excited to talk about this really important topic today. Well, before we learn even how to avoid these fees, let's figure out what they are. What are some of those most common fees that we as consumers are looking at? Well, consumers are paying more fees than ever across so many different categories. So from restocking and reshipping fees when you're shopping to early termination fees if you're trying to cancel a gym membership or switch mobile carriers and financial service providers charge fees as well. So you may be paying ATM fees or overdraft fees and of course credit card fees and all these fees will make getting out of debt even harder. So it's important to research options and look for ways to avoid these fees when possible. And that's really why I'm so excited to be working with Marcus by Goldman Sachs to help consumers find ways to better manage their money and not pay any fees if possible. Well, yeah, we definitely want to try to avoid those. But before we even do anything in the future, we have to also handle the debt we already have. How can I kind of manage what I've got on my plate already? Of course. Well, a lot of people don't realize that there are other options when it comes to credit card debt, like debt consolidation. And in fact, a survey by the brand found that 77% of consumers, credit worthy consumers who are in credit card debt, don't realize that they can use a personal loan to pay down their debt. And personal loans are a great tool to better manage your debt because you save money compared to the high interest rate that you're paying on your credit card. And I find that it's a lot easier to manage one payment that's due every day compared to managing several different credit cards that may be due on different days of the month. That's when consumers get into trouble. They forget when their credit card is due. They pay late. They might be slapped with a penalty APR and then pay late fees. So again, personal loan is just a really great option if you, if you feel like you just can't get out of your debt. Well, and once we're going to go shop for that personal loan, now that we know it's available and all the great benefits that come along with it, what should I be looking for when I'm shopping for that loan? When you're shopping for a personal loan, of course it's important to compare interest rates. But beyond the interest rate, you want to find out if the lenders charge any fees. People don't realize that there are fees that are charged. So lenders may charge up to 5% just as a sign-up fee. And that means if you're applying for a $10,000 loan, you're only going to get $9,500. $500 of that is just going to go as a sign-up fee. And that's not going to help you pay off your debt faster. And so that's why Marcus by Goldman Sachs, which is is an online lender offering fixed rate, no fee personal loans to consumers with good credit, so scores of 660 or higher, they don't charge any fees ever. So that means there are no sign up fees, there are no prepayment fees, and there are no late fees. So you only pay interest for the additional days. It's just such a great tool to help you save. Well, where can I go online to learn more about that? And of course, uh, start my new year off on a good financial foot. Of course, go to Marcus.com, check out their options there, and also look at the free savings calculator on the homepage. It'll show you how much you'll save compared to your existing credit card debt. Well, you said it from the beginning, this is an important topic, so I wanna thank you so much for giving us all this info. Of course, thank you for having me on. Don't go anywhere. The Morning Blend, we'll be right back.